I think it's more likely than not that we'll never have another Labour government. I think the the playing field is tilted too much towards the Tories and is continuing to be tilted more and more. And in that environment, it becomes quite difficult to sort of motivate yourself to, uh, you know, to do normal political canvassing. And um, none of us feel particularly inspired by uh, the Labour Party. Uh, Keir Starmer doesn't really seem to understand that actually politics today is all about how you make people feel. He doesn't have the ability to make people feel anything. And I think that's one of the reasons why Labour is languishing in the polls. Yeah. The Conservative Party has emasculated um, Parliament. Parliament feels irrelevant um, to many of us. Um, I think because it is irrelevant to many of us, not just because of an 80-seat majority, but because of a whole host of other um, developments in the political landscape brought in under cover of the pandemic. Um, we now have um, quite close to sort of autocratic power resting in the hands of uh, Boris Johnson. Um, you know, the thing that really um, shocks me actually is um, you know, once upon a time, I mean, as recently as um, 2000 and the 2010 um, Parliament, we had sort of opposition day debates. And I think, is it twice every term, the opposition would get to nominate a subject for debate. And um, it would be a debate that you would choose with the desire of embarrassing the government on something um, they should be embarrassed on. Uh, every government screws stuff up. Um, and government, recognising that this was a really important type of accountability, would turn up to those opposition day debates and they'd um, win uh, the vote because uh, they had a majority in parliament, which is why they were the government. Um, but they would accept that that was a really important part of parliamentary democracy, of accountability through parliament. And now, um, very often, government just doesn't turn up. So Labour um, notionally sits in, a, in an empty chamber, um, arguing with nobody because government has contempt for the parliamentary process. And it's very, very difficult um, for the Labour Party to be heard. I, I think, um, I mean, I sort of, I, I, I'm not, I'm, I want to be very clear, I'm not making a comparison between the Labour Party and Good Law Project. But um, I also feel as though the Labour Party to me feels kind of irrelevant. I imagine it feels irrelevant to a lot of people watching this evening and i imagine it feels irrelevant to the media as well and um that's a really really dangerous state of affairs thanks for watching this clip from ddn live if you want to watch the whole video simply click the link below but most importantly support the incredible work of double down news by visiting their patreon page and becoming a patron now join the future of journalism support alternative analysis to the mainstream media